Hey, hello, welcome. So friend, in this video, we are going to learn how we can create AP invoices in Oracle Fusion. So for creating any transaction in Fusion, first you need to log in the application. So as you can see, I have already logged in, in the applications. So once you will log in, you need to navigate to the application that is the Payables. So as I am going to create Payables invoices, so I need to navigate to the Payables application. Inside the Payables application, we have different different work area. So for creating transaction or for creating AP invoices, we need to work, we, we need to go for the AP, uh, invoices work area. So once you will click here in the invoices work area, you will get to know that the new pages. So here you can see this is the dashboard there. It's showing basic uh, like details related to the invoices that how many invoices available in the validation status and how many related to the purchasing and others. So what we need to do is that for creating the transaction or creating the AP invoices, we need to click here on the task icon. Once you will click, you will get many options. So as we are going to create a new invoices, so we have to click on that create invoices. If we have to find or search invoices, we will go for manage invoice. So right now I have to create on that create invoices. And once you will click on that create invoices, there are many, many of uh, options or values you can see that is already defined so it's based on the uh, based on the configuration whatever we have done for the users and the business units so for creating purchase uh, ap invoices we need we require some details we require header details that you can see this is the invoice header details and here in the section we have line details tax details and totals so tax and this totals can be the uh, can be the configuration part if for the particular for the business unit or for the suppliers if there is taxation then you need to go to the taxes the taxes tab else you can escape that one so right now what i have to do is that first i need to fill the header part so here you can see in header part we, i need to mention the invoice number so suppose i am going to give you invoice number as x x i n v test 001 this is the invoice number 001 i am i want to create and here we have to Pass the invoice amount so my invoice amount will be 5000 and here you, we need to select the supplier what suppliers for what we are going to create the ap invoices so i have to pass i have already defined the suppliers here so i will select the supplier from here only and based on the supplier you will select that the supplier site and legal entity will reflect here right so here we have already the details I don't want to change the supplier site and all and also I, you can see the payment term date already defined here and the the transaction date you can see that will be coming from the line so here we need to just expand the line tab in, in the line tab you can see we have to fill the details related to the how many items will be there or how many lines will be there for invoices so I just want to create two lines so as I have 5000 so I will go first line will be the to something like that 2500 and distribution set or distribution co combination both of one you can provide anything so I, I have already copied the distribution combination so I will pass here and here you can see this is the accounting date so just I don't want to change accounting date that will be the same and the rest of the details is default I don't want to do any changes here so I will go for the second line in the second line I will give you the same amount again so that it will be 5000 total and the code combination it will be same and this fine done so i have already given all the details related to creating the ap invoices so now what we need to do is that we need to just save so that the invoice will be created in oracle fusion so here you can see once i have done the save icon save button you can see the new option it shows that not validated so it means invoice, invoice our invoice created but it is not in the valid status it's in the status of not validated so if you will see let me copy the invoice number and save and close so if i will search the invoice you can see so right now invoice created for searching we need to go to the manage invoice and if i will pass the invoice number and click on this search you can see the same invoice whatever we created right now it will be reflected here you can see the invoice number which we created right now and its status if you will see the status is not validated for making this validated what we need to do is that just we need to edit this invoice again so no so what we need to we need to just open this invoice by clicking here and here you can see in the action we have option to validate so once you will click here 
this status will be changed to validated so now our invoice is validated so what we have done is that we have created the invoice and we have validated the invoice so guys thank you so much for watching if you have any other queries and want to ask anything just do comment and obvious if you have not subscribed this channel yet please subscribe now thank you so much for watching